DNR American Bullies. How are everybody doing today? We back at it again. I want to thank everybody for like, comment, subscribe to our page. Even to the new subscribers, we appreciate it. We appreciate it. I hope y'all having a good day. So, um, if we was due for another video, um, hopefully my um, two females take. If they do, it's going to be amazing. Y'all don't want to miss it. If anybody interested in a puppy, just shoot me a message. Um, you can hit me up on here or you can hit me with 585-851-9507. And um, yeah, like I see my subscribe is going up. I'm happy. Um, I remember I was at 50 and 70 for a while. But um, let me fix the camera. It looked like the camera got tipped down. But now nah, it's good. Let y'all check. But yeah, um, we came a long way. I would have never thought. I would have never thought we would have made it this far. Never. And I put I put my all into it. Because this is what I love to do. And I'm, I'm going to tell y'all a little about me. I'm 32. Um, I've been breeding pit bulls before I got to American Bullies because I could have never afforded one. Um, I'm a teacher. I teach three and four year old all day. Been doing it for nine years. Um, yeah, I love... I love Working with kids, you know, and I love dogs. Um, I made my mind up next year. I'm going to try to go, um, do online classes to be a vet. So I'm going to go to school for that. And um, you got to do what you do. You got to do what you got to do for your family and what you love to do. You know what I mean? If I can work with kids and um, bees. If I could work with kids and animals, that'd be great. Um, I missed the um, the classes for being a dog warden. I was gonna be a dog warden around my town, but I missed the classes. So that's only once a year, and I have to wait on that if I do decide to do that again. Um, but yeah, like I love dogs. I love dogs. Um, Especially American bullies, <laughs> like that's a whole different breed, man. Like these dogs, they so different than other dogs, and and I like it. Like we as DNR American bully, me and my wife, she she my backbone, y'all. She, she hold me tight, and she she's not wasn't into dogs like I was. She was never into it. But I, she kind of, I can't say she didn't have a choice because she had a choice. But I guess she's doing it because of me. And that's a great wife. Y'all got a wife to hold y'all down. Keep pushing. <laughs> because you'll never get another wife to try to hold you down. But, but yeah, this is my girl Carlita, if y'all didn't know. I, I bred her to Onyx. For the new subscribers didn't know in Nairobi she went to Rocky um, but yeah like I went through a lot to get my dogs a lot a lot of money a lot of everything and I did what I had to do to get them you know what I mean I worked my butt off my wife helped me because she know this is my passion and And yes, I will be keeping one off of each, maybe two off of Carlita. We don't know yet. But I got something for you guys next year. Um, sometimes, I see it on Facebook. If you're going to pay little bucks to get a bully, that's what it's going to turn out to. And if you're going to pay the 4 and 5 and 3K for American Bully... That's what that's going to turn out to. But that's a different subject. 
I'm gonna save that for another video when it when it when it falls in place. I got some for you guys. Uh, I know I'm gonna love it. Hopefully, you guys gonna love it because you guys watch my video. Um, I'm getting used to it. The videos. I'm trying to make it where you guys don't watch half of it or a little of it, then you cut it off because you wasn't into it. You know what I mean? So I'm trying to make videos which you guys gonna gonna watch. You know what I mean? Mostly people don't want to watch the the kennel owner talking the whole time. Maybe people want to watch just the dogs moving and all that. You know what I mean? So like, but I really haven't made a video of me um, explaining everything about my dogs because I was a little nervous. I'm still nervous. I might be a little tongue-tied. Excuse me, y'all. But I was never the person who could talk in front of a lot of people. And right now I'm talking in, from, in front of a thousand some people. It's going to be a thousand some people to watch my videos. You know what I mean? So I'm trying to build my, my stuff up. You know what I mean? Build myself up. But it's hard. It really is. Some people is made for it. And, like, my dogs, I was told the dog acts like the owner. If you are laid back cool, your dog gonna be. And, like, right now, all my dogs are just chilling. And another thing is when you want to buy your puppy, you want to buy it from someone that you going to vibe with. If you, don't, if you don't catch a vibe with... I don't know everything. I'm just starting off, y'all. So I'm just shooting things out there. You know what I mean? If, if you guys want to comment, and you know what I mean, if I'm saying something wrong, go ahead. You know? It ain't going to hurt me. I can take it. Um, but, like I was saying, like, your dog act like you. And if you chill and everything, your dog going to be chill. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> but I, I'm tongue-tied. See, told y'all. But the dogs, like, I do a lot with my dogs. I get up in the morning. I take care of them before work. When I get out of work, I take care of them, let them get their run. It's good to let your dog run. You know what I mean? Like, my dogs, they got to run. They can't just sit, lay there. I'm making them move. You know what I mean? I take them for a two-mile walk. I try to do it every day if it ain't raining. Um, like this morning, I took my dogs for a walk. I fed them. They just got done eating. And I'm gonna do it again tonight. Like, I'm out here with my dogs 24 seven. Like, like I was saying, I'm gonna tell y'all more about my I'm a teacher. Like, did I want to be it? Yes. Did I want to work with animals at the time? Yes. But, Excuse me. Excuse me. But I went at the time with the animals. I like was more passionate working with kids. Me and my wife, we don't have no kids yet. I'm waiting for the day I get that message, that phone call, that morning, wake me up, baby. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm, 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 I can't wait for that day because it's nice to have kids. It is. Some some people don't want kids. Some people do. Like, if I could, man, I had at least five kids running in this yard, y'all. Take Hey, take care of the dog. You know what I mean? <laughs> hey, take the dog for a walk. But sometimes it don't work out like that. Sometimes you got to be patient. And I'm learning to be patient, y'all. I am really learning to be patient because the most thing that kills me is the patient part, y'all. Like, I was never the patient part. I was never a patient guy. Like, if I see something I want, I just jump on it. I wouldn't wait. I wouldn't think about it. I just do it. And I'm starting to be that patient guy. And as the dogs, I went through it in dogs. I went through like at least four or five dogs, y'all, at least. And that was a lot of money. I went through it. And I should have waited. Listen to the wife and wait it out and spend one big chunk of money on one good dog. I didn't do it. So, like I said, that's a whole different subject. I got something to show y'all. Not now, 
But when I do, I'm going to do a video on it first. And then we're going to do a video. But yeah, today, I'm going to make my way out to Nairobi and Rocky Sun. We're going to go to the Sun House. Um, Zane, um, my wife's best friend got him. And uh, we're going to go out there and let Rocky play with his son today. We're going to do videos. I'm going to add it to the end of this so y'all guys can check it out. Please watch the whole video through because I want to see y'all comments on how Zane's son is and what y'all think about him. Because I'm going to tell you from me looking at him all the time, he's bigger than Rocky. Rocky and Nairobi killed that first letter, man. I'm telling you. And hopefully... It happens again. If I get a Zane out of that um, this litter again, like I did out of the first litter, best believe he will be staying at DNR American Bullies. I beat on myself all the time about that. But sometimes you don't know till the puppy get about six months, eight months old, you know, or before then. As me being my first breeder, I didn't. I was watching everybody's videos, seeing what they was looking for in a puppy and all that. But me, I just wanted to see what they produce. And they produce amazing puppies out of it. When I say amazing, I mean amazing. What's up, mama? Uh, this is my girl, Carlita Young. Like, she, I got her from Montana, New York. Like, she is so sweet, yo. When I say sweet, sweet. Um, the only time they go in the shed is um, sometimes in the winter time they'll go in the shed or sometimes they'll be in the house. But I'm trying to move stuff around out here. Um, thanks to a family member, my wife, um, uncle, he gave me some rocks. So um, I'm going to put some rocks in their kennel. So she's trying to get in my lap now. I'm going to put some rocks in their kennels. And, um, help out in there a little but yeah this is my girl Carlita y'all but yeah my passion with dogs started when I was 10 11 I loved the dogs y'all and like when you you could tell when someone loved their dogs man some people have dogs just for money or or whatever but you can tell when someone really got passion for their dogs. Like, when I be watching videos, I can tell that mostly everybody got passion for their dogs. I can tell. And it, it's amazing, like, how all my subscribers, my new subscribers, like, I appreciate y'all. Y'all motivate me to keep posting these videos on my dogs. It might be something that you don't like, but you guys still give me positive comments, and I appreciate it. You know what I mean? And and I watch all you guys' video, man. Like, why would I have you guys, want you guys to subscribe to my channel when I don't subscribe or watch your video? No. I'm going to pay that back. You know what I mean? And I'm a cool dude. Like, my dogs, I can take them anywhere. My niece and nephew, um, they be here with them. Like, all my dogs are amazing. They great with kids. I mean, great. Cats, um, everything. I don't know if y'all seen one of my pictures or videos on Facebook or YouTube. I had a kitten. And you know, I test Rocky out. They was laying right beside each other. If y'all can't, go back and watch the video. If I find it before y'all, I'm going to um, get that clip out of it. And I'm going to post it on this at the end of the video. But, yes, like... Everybody that have my puppy, they love them. They happy. They send me pictures, a lot of them. Like, like the guy in Canada, Leon. <laughs> Great guy, man. Great guy. He, he writes me every day. And, um, like, this guy do so good with his dogs. Like, he teach UFC and do UFC. And at the same time, he come home and he take care of his dogs. Everything. Like, Amanda. She got Zane. She take great care of him. My cousin, he got um, a bell. Great care. Like everybody, the lady that lives two seconds, five minutes down the road from me got two females from me. 
great care. They got, I probably say an acre. They run. The lady take great care of them. Like everybody that got a puppy from me, they always sending me pictures. And it was a couple. They got, they recently got married. And they got the run. Oh my goodness. She is amazing. She still got her ears. Um, I was the only one that when I, I had cut my keeper female, kept the ear, cut the ears on, cropped the ears. But everybody else, they kept the ears on theirs. And they look amazing. They really do. And um, if everything goes good with Carlita, I think I'm 110% think she already, if she got enough puppies in her, she already sold. All of them already sold, spoken for her. Um, I got a few spots open for Rocky and Nairobi, and um, I decide, like, I love my dogs, and um, I won't change it for anything, but I decide that I'm going to go pocket or a screen pocket. I just, I just love the muscle and everything in them. Like, everything is amazing, and I won't change that for the world, so... I want to thank everybody that has been liking, comment, subscribe, um, please share. I want to thank you guys. And um, y'all keep coming with them amazing videos too, because that motivate me. And I'll be watching everybody's video that subscribe to me. And um, keep it coming, y'all, because DNR, we got something special for y'all next year. And y'all ain't going to want to miss it. I'm telling you, you ain't going to want to miss it. And, um... I'm going to keep y'all posted when I confirm it. I'm going to post it on here, on YouTube. And um, we got Rocky over there asleep. Nairobi sleep. Carlita, she right here keeping an eye. See who's here in the driveway. Um, but yeah, y'all enjoy this weather. Please like, comment, subscribe, share. And um, tell me what you think about it. And we're just going to shoot from there. Peace. Look at my girl, y'all. What's up, mamas? You chilling, mamas? We got Nairobi over there sleeping. Night, night. Hey, mamas. Rocky, he just got up. Yeah, I'm about to pit rocks, clean their cage out, and um, let them both run, and we about to just chill. Peace. I'm from Rocky to see his son. This is Rocky's son, Zane. Sorry if y'all see my wife's toes in there. Like little monsters. Look at, look at Zane. That's Rocky's son. Rocky trying to act bad. You good, boy. Yes. No. That's what I did. Oh. You gotta, you gotta watch that. No. Zing. This is Zing. Me and Zing area now. Fence then. Oh, he does got 